Give me hate. No, we got a we got a treat for you now. The guy that uh, that wrote Scott's theme song is here tonight, Mr. Tom Feller, and we're going to have him come around and sing that for you. He's a he's a wonderful writer. He got another song in it that you got to hear. It's a good one. But he, he wrote this song, and, and he was the one that that uh, got me got me uh, connected with Scott. He uh, he said, "Have you seen this guy work on these buses?" I said, "No." He said, "Man, go check this out." He said, "This guy knows what he's doing." And so I went and, went and checked out the videos, and I said, "Man, he does." He, uh, I can tell when somebody's working on something if they know what they're doing. They just the way they work, I can tell. And so uh, I got contacted Scott, and he's kept us on the road many many a time. And I appreciate you so much. But we're gonna have Tom come around and. and uh, have you seen this song? I know you're going to join. What do you call this song? It's actually called, uh, we call it the Bus Grease Monkey theme song, I guess. And I, I'm going to give you a, I'm not making any excuses or anything, but I've only sang this like twice since I recorded it, two years ago. So please bear with me if I sing words that you don't recognize. It's probably just... I don't so make up some <laughs> I'm just making up as I go. I'm gonna try my best to get the right words, but I also had to rewrite this song three times because you know there was no such thing as a 40s pre-war yeah, pre forties. <laughs> so you know, you'll have it. But anyway, I'm gonna try to get through this in uh, the best we can, and then uh, we'll see how it goes. So all right, yes. He's loading up his tools, check the air from the stools. It's that bus grease monkey, don't you know? Well, he's got a long hop to ride, an old lady in a silver side. Get that bus grease monkey, drive the road. Well, he's got that hammer down in that 47 M. It's that bus grease monkey, don't you know? He pedals all the road. Let him tell you. 
Well, I got another surprise for you, Scott. I wrote another song earlier this week, actually last weekend, and I recorded it earlier this week. I'm going to be sending it to you, but I want to play it for you live first. This one, we might sell 45 or 50 of these. So, what is, there's a couple of things that inspired me to write this song. One of them was, uh, we've had, what, three buses now that haven't made it up the hill? <laughs> so there's one inspiration that I had. Kelsey said, well, that's a heavy hill down there. How do these buses get up? And I said, they're in good shape, but they don't get up the hill. That's right, that's right. So the other thing was, it's been a while since I've heard anything about it, and, and don't feel obligated by me doing this, but... I've kind of named your property here. So there was some talk on YouTube a while back and Patreon about what 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 the property should be named. And I really don't care what it's named, it's your property. But anyway, here's a song that might influence your decision on that. I don't know. But we'll see how it goes here. I'll go ahead and kick this off. It's cheaper than <laughs> Do our 